Hi, this is Eric, and today we'll be doing a 2D structural example inside MetQ. This demo was also done inside AbbeyCAD or AutoCAD-like standalone. First, go down to the MetQ pull-down and select the Grid ID tool. And from here, we can create bubbles and center lines. We'll move this to the center layer and changes the line type and then we'll copy this whole thing over and copy this grid bubble to the left and repeat the whole process. And finally we'll just go ahead and copy the center line down stretch these down over and simply double click on each of these to change the annotation and now we'll go under the MetQ menu again and we'll choose drawing scale and we'll change this to quarter inch equals a foot and we'll choose the W shape and then we'll come down to config and we'll check our settings. We want to make sure bomb is turned on, repeat, and annotate. Now we can go ahead and choose our shape and insert it. Rotate it at zero degrees. And insert our annotation as well. Let me just take this and copy it over to center line B. Now we can insert an S shape in top view. Zoom down, select the intersections. and rotate our annotation again. Now we can take this whole configuration and copy it down to center line too. And then we'll insert two more S shape beams. Copy this over. Okay, now we have most of the configuration done. Let's go ahead and run a bill of materials on it. We we'll select do bomb, then we select all, and then it will ask us for the upper right insert point. And now from here we can just start bubbling our beams. As you can see, it's automatically numbering them and then it's populating the schedule at the same time. Now we'll exit this and we can go in and change our dim scale. Let's change it to 36 because we're going to be doing a detail here on the left side and we want our text to appear larger. So We can check the settings in that dialog and then we enter in the beam length and then clean up the drawing a little bit overlapping dimensions Now we need to just kind of move these drawings around a little bit so that they all fit snugly together because we're going to be plotting this out on an 8.5 by 11 sheet. We'll change our print style to monochrome and our scale to quarter inch. And then as far as our print area we want to just do extents and then we can preview it and we're ready to go. Hope this has been helpful and feel free to call me. Number here is 888-271-7121. Ask me about MetQ for AutoCAD or LT or 
If you don't have CAD, ask us about AviCAD, our CAD standalone that comes with MetQ included. Thanks and have a great day.